Here they are. Get them while they're warm. Hey, Rusty, what's in these? In case my doctor needs to know. Let me tell you wise guys something. When I was on payroll, we respected our elders. I come in here, I volunteer. Do I get a thank you, Rusty? No, I get jokes, and they aren't even funny jokes. They're old and stale. Come on, Rusty, we all love you, you know that. Look, I'm eating one. Hey, hey, Carl with a K. Mr. Monk. Oh, hell, he's back. Hey, Chucky, you, you missed a spot. Captain, can you believe it's been a year already? You know, Mr. Monk, I told you you can test those smoke alarms at home by yourself. Yeah, I know, uh, I know, but I'd rather you guys did it. You're the experts, right? House fire, three alarm. Mr. Monk, I'm afraid you're gonna have to wait. Captain, I was here first. Sir, there's a house burning down five blocks away. Don't you think that should take priority right now? Uh, Don't you? Let's go. Okay, but I don't have all day. How many rooms do you have? Five. 30 smoke detectors for five rooms? Plus two hallways and a vestibule. I used to say you can't be too careful. Never say that again. Excuse me. Hello? Hey. You're not allowed back here. Rusty? Rusty? Rusty, okay. Check on Rusty. I think he's dead. Uh, what happened? I don't know. There was a man. I tried to stop him. Mr. Monk, it's okay. It's all over now. You can open your eyes. Uh, oh, my God. Captain Stolmeyer, please. It's an emergency. Uh, don't say anything. It's, it's okay. Just sit over there, all right? There's a chair right there. Where? 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 Right over there. Natalie, I, I can't see it. Let's go, let's go. Nice, Julie. Keep your hands up, slide your feet. That's it, Tiger. Emily, you know when they set the screen that you have to get through it. Which Emily? All the Emilys. All right, come on, girls, let's try it again. Come on, guys, we can do this. Like that, Coach Hayden? Coach Hayden. Yes, that was much better. Okay, girls, let's huddle up. All right, one week to go. This is it. Do you feel like champions? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, you are champions. And you're always gonna be champions, no matter who's coaching you. Okay, Monday, 3.30 practice. Anyone's late? We're all doing laps. Oh my gosh. All right, Cougars on three. One, One, two, two three, three, cougars! All right, girls, hit the showers. How are you doing, Julie? Oh, I'm good. <laughs> You're looking great out there. You're getting a lot more range on your shots. Thanks. Coach Hayden, what do you mean, no matter who's coaching you? I just meant that you, the team, the girls, they're all a lot more important than me. <laughs> Go on, hit the showers. Bye. Good night. See you Monday. See you, Coach Hayden. Hello? Hello?
that skyline. It's the second most beautiful sight in the world. The most beautiful is you standing in front of it. Are you okay? You, you didn't say five words at dinner. Jay, remember you said we couldn't go on like this. You said I had to make a decision. You were right. I'm going back to Eric. I'm going to try and make it work. What? He's my husband, Jay. I tried to tell you at dinner. I don't know. I didn't want to ruin your birthday. Let's go somewhere, just the two of us. We can go to Bahia Tortolo for the week. I can get Dr. Eastman to cover my patients. No, Jay, you're not listening. It's over. We can leave on Monday. The boat's already what stopped. What is your problem? Up. I'm not going anywhere with you except back to shore. Whatever you say. Please, just take me home. I suppose you've told Eric everything. Are you kidding? You haven't told anyone? I'm not exactly proud of this. So, it's like it never happened. That's one way to look at it. Never happened. What are you doing out of bed? Oh. Are gorgeous! <laughs> yes, and uh, you got a movie opening up on Friday. Mm -hmm. And uh, by the way, I saw it last night. Jiggle me timbers! <laughs> it was a long two and a half hours, boy. Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, hey, Max, you've been saying that all morning. Jiggle me timbers. Where'd you get that? Well, maybe it'll be my new catchphrase. I didn't know I had to clear everything with the lollipop gill. Yeah, whoa, whoa, hey. careful, boss. <laughs> Willie will beat the crap out of your kneecap. <laughs> or higher, even. You guys. Well, hey, no, I, I think it'll catch on. Jiggle me timbers! <laughs> oh, you're listening to Mad Max in the morning. Uh, we're talking with... Kimberly Daneman, whose new movie is opening everywhere on Friday. And closing everywhere on Saturday. <laughs> Kimberly. 
gas leak. I can smell it. Yeah, shut off the main valve, but we gotta check inside just to make sure. All right. Coming from upstairs, I hear voices. Sounds like a radio. Hello? Hello? Better check upstairs. Oh my God. That's what's his name from the radio? <laughs> Max Hudson. A gas leak at Max Hudson's house. Oh, he's going to have a field day with this. Yeah. I'll turn the gas off. Say sanctity. Sanctity. Close enough! <laughs> Close you... enough! I'll be right back. Hey, Max, there's a cop on line 1E. He says it's important. Okay, uh, I'll just take in the back, all right? Anybody you know? No? Hello? Speaking? My wife? Oh my God, is she all right? Yes, sir. I, I understand. I'll be right there. Hey! 